Today we're going to be taking a look at the Supermax 1632 drum sander, part number SUP MX-71632. Here we have the Supermax 1632 drum sander. A couple of the main features that really set this apart is the labor savings and the dust savings in your shop or workspace. If you're working with wood, you're going to have to sand it at some point. Whether you're using a hand sander or a random orbit sander, you're still gonna have to use a lot of manual labor and time to sand your pieces. Using a drum sander, you're able to take your material, feed it through here, and it does all the work for you. Not only does it save on time, it saves on actual manual labor. One of the ways that it saves on labor and time, as it is, you can sand larger pieces all at once instead of having to use a hand sander, as it is 16 inches wide, which is where it gets its name. 16, because that's the size of the drum, but it also has 32. The reason it's 32 is because it is open-ended here, so you can sand items that are 16 inches or smaller, or all the way up to 32, because that's the double width of the drum. You can run it through one way, flip it around, run it through the other, so you can do pieces up to 32 inches wide, which saves a ton of time. One of the issues is, if you're trying to sand something larger than the size of your sander, is you don't want to leave a ridge where the end of the drum is. So one of the features of the Supermax drum sander is you're able to take the drum slightly out of parallel when you're sanding things that are wider than 16 inches with a quick release lever over here. That barely takes this out of level, so it doesn't leave a ridge on your piece when you're going through it. Once you flip it around, go through the rest of the way, and now the entire piece is sanded smooth with no ridge in the middle where the drum sander would leave it. When you're ready to sand things that are 16 inches or smaller, all you have to do, pull a little quick lever on the side, puts everything back in parallel with the conveyor belt, and you're ready to start sanding again. Another feature that really sets the Supermax 1632 drum sander apart from its competitors is the ease of raising the drum up and down so you can set your height adjustment on your sanding items. Here on the side, at the top, you have a hand crank, and you can see, you have a ruler right here, so you can get a fine adjustment, but sometimes you don't want to sit here and have to crank this. If you're going from half inch all the way up to three inches, there's a quick lever on top that all you have to do is switch it, and here on the side, there's a lever. You can bring it up, bring it down, so you can set your piece in there, get it to close to where you want it, flip the lever back, and then fine tune it exactly to the height you need to sand your piece. That again, cuts down on labor and time when you're working on items. For an example, this cutting board is about an inch thick. You don't have to sit here and crank the handle all the way down to lower down into the right position. You're able to flip your handle, bring down the drum to where it's barely touching, flip it back, and then fine tune it to the exact height that you need, turn your sander on, and you can get to sanding. Once you have the machine set up and you follow the directions to get your digital scale for the height set up, it'll have it zero. When it is at zero, that means the drum is touching the conveyor belt. So once you raise it, it'll give you a digital readout of the height of your drum. Not only does it give you inches and millimeters on the side, it gives you fractions if you'd rather have that number. Now let's talk about the conveyor belt system. Here on the front of it, you have a knob that goes from zero to 100. That adjusts the speed of it. You turn it on and you can adjust the speed. If you need to slow down, you can turn the knob. If you want to go quicker, turn it all the way up. Something else that really is unique about this conveyor belt, it has something called the IntelliSand system. So, say you have it set on 50 and the machine is afraid that it's gonna start burning the wood, it'll adjust the conveyor belt to the speed that it thinks it should be going through the drum sander so it doesn't burn your wood. Whether it needs to slow down or speed it up, the IntelliSand system will activate, the light will come on, and it'll adjust the conveyor belt as needed so you, it's a fail safe so you don't burn your wood. But here on the front, you just push this in and the top flips open and you can get to your drum on both ends of the drum as a quick release system so you can easily put your roll in there, roll it, keep it tight, and get to the other end, pull the lever up, feed your paper in there, and it's tight. A unique thing about that is once you start using the paper, it tends to stretch a little bit and those will keep tension on it even when this starts to stretch. It'll automatically compensate for that and keep the roll tight on the drum. Another unique feature about the Supermax 1632 drum sander is here you can see the turbine fins in the dust extraction port. That is a four inch port. So you can run a four inch hose from your sander 
to your dust extractor. What that does is help with airflow coming from your dust extractor to help with dust moving from the drum and out of the machine. This feature, a 1.5 horsepower motor that is wired for 110 volt. Looking at the controls on the front of it, super simple. You have the red switch on the front that turns on your drum sander, and right here, that turns on your conveyor belt. Another thing that I really like about the Supermax drum sander is it does have an option to get these additional in-feet and out-feet tables. That makes works a lot easier. And those are part number SUPMX-71632-7F. Not only does it make it easier for it to hold longer materials up so you don't have to sit there and hold it as much, a lot of the issue is working in a workshop, you don't have a lot of room. As you can see, with the table out, it does take up a lot of space. What Supermax did, they were made it to where you can fold these down out of the way. There's two buttons on each side. All you do is push it down, those fold out of the way, and that really cuts down on the size of your machine. When you're ready to use it, all you have to do is come over, raise your in-feed and out-feed tables, they click into place, and you're ready to start sanding. And with that, that'll conclude our look at the Supermax 1632 drum sander, part number SUP MX-71632.